in the gate, ready for the start of the Classic. And they're off to the cheers of the crowd and guided tour breaks alertly with Orientate. Albert the Great is gun to the lead. That's Albert the Great, Ore Chavez puts him in front, but Pat Day and Orientate are gonna take the fight to him. And those two hook up in a speed duel in the first furlong here. Tis now not far behind. He's running third in the early going. Guided Tour drops back to run along in fourth. Galileo, only five lengths from the lead, he's fifth. The arc winner, Saki, is sixth on the outside. And the favorite, Aptitude, is now running in seventh. Macho Uno bulls his way through from eighth now. Black Benelouch is ninth. Include is down toward the inside, and he's now tenth. Freedom Crest, Gander, who's well in hand, and at the back of the pack is long shot up late Spencer. The quarter went in 23 and one fifth seconds, a grueling pace here, and into the wind half of 47 seconds flat. Albert the Great grinding it out on a short lead now. Orientate couldn't stay with them. There goes Guided Tour, who splits horses decisively with five furlongs to go. And on the outside, the daunting presence of a horse of the year. Tis now, and he's right there, just off the pace fourth. Saki and Galileo right there and behind the lead. Macho knows in the thick of it as Aptitude begins to roll here with three and a half furlongs to go in the Classic, and it is Albert the Great blazing the way. Tis now looms in second. Saki is there on the outside. Guided Tour fights on. Galileo's under a heavy drive. He's still six lengths behind. Include will put his run through on the rail. Aptitude is taken wide by Gander, and the field turns for home. Here comes the arc winner, Saki, and he storms to the lead. Saki in there. Stretch.